بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم uh, الصلاة والسلام على رسول الله In today's video I want to show you uh, uh, one of the my projects that I did uh, for a serv uh, seven story building uh, which is in Baghdad I modeled uh, this one before two years ago uh, if we look at the model uh, let's uh, take a look to the model if it's it's a huge model uh, and the my computer is not uh, such a good computer uh, that uh, I can access uh, like this but what I did I had I had a tutorial about this one I, I want to I want to show you the, the details here uh, but before I show you the details I uh, modeled uh, uh, or I, I had a, a tutorial about how we can uh, get with the huge uh, models how we can uh, open huge models in in uh, a computer that's not not uh, such a powerful computer okay as you see here if you look at here uh, for these bolts if you see the bolts and the features I uh, <coughs> what I did I hide all the bolts in uh, here all the bolts that we have I hide it so as to be uh, uh, so as to be uh, powerful. I can also hide the features right um, just by selecting this one and select similar uh, Select similar and after that and just I can go to uh, the uh, uh, advanced properties and From the display type what I can do I can just go to features and I can go to my, or uh, come back to standard so why we make these or What's the benefit of this procedure? If you look at it's, uh, the <coughs> the benefit of this procedure is to hide all the features inside the edge here, where before we had we had a we had a, a features inside this one, but when now we delete it or we we hide it, uh, it's better. As you see, this one also we have uh, these features in the beams just you can just select this one right click select similar and again go to advanced properties and from the display type from the display type we can just uh, change it to standard <coughs> okay we can just uh, change it uh, this one to standard or we can adjust, uh, we can use simply if it's uh, if it's more uh, <coughs> as here it's just a symbol that uh, we have some beams here but I think it's not uh, good for us and it's uh, so we will uh, change back to standard uh, also we hide some features uh, inside these beam holes also as you see that is, uh, is mm, better than before however uh, I can I can uh, hide the, the place for example I don't need place so I can hide place or I can hide anything or anything that I want where I can hide it and it's no problem as you see here uh, we have um, let me show you some some joints inside uh, this is a, a splice connection that we made uh, and uh, maybe you you ask uh, ask me why we, we we make like this for example sometimes sometimes when you when you have a, a large bill uh, sections or a large uh, building you can make some supply supplies why because if we make this this uh, beam with one uh, piece it will we will have waste waste in, in material so that's why we can make some supplies uh, supplies in the beam but in the supplies of course it should be in uh, the safe we ha have to be on the safe side and this one also here we have an, another connection which is the shear connection uh, this uh, the, this connection is the shear connection and this is the plate for uh, making uh, <coughs> more stability or uh, less, uh, decreasing uh, more uh, increasing the, the uh, joint strength or the joint capacity we have another another one another uh, the joint as you see here we have two joints we, what we uh, what I used for this one for this joint <coughs> I'm sorry I used the shear plate with this connection so it's two, uh, two connections inside one 
one connection. I used uh, this connection twice. And this is, uh, as you see here, we have a moment connection here. Uh, and of course, we have some of the connections. Uh, we have this one, the shear, uh, shear connection. As you see here, this is the shear connection, which uh, uh, this is a shear connection. And what is this? Uh, if we look at here, let's go to uh, here. Yeah, I think. Yeah, this the this the the or what is the? It is yeah. This one. Not edging. Uh, this the. <coughs> I'm sorry. This is one of the, the important things that we have to make when when we we make modeling, which is the. Uh, let me show you first. As you see, it needs some time to some time to uh, make here because it's a, a very huge uh, structure. We can just move it like this. As you see, <coughs> if you go to home from here, Project Explorer, and we see we have model views we can just uh, click here or click anywhere we want any uh, of the model view for example we want to f so it shows us only this one choose by clicking we will wait until it comes and we have another type of connection uh, which is the concrete steel connection so as you see we can uh, see the, the grids that we want let's take uh, a look uh, let's take a look to the uh, drawings or before the drawings uh, let's take a look uh, to um, some of the other joints that we made uh, as we said, we have uh, some plates inside uh, some areas which is there for the bracing. These plates are for bracing. I didn't model the bracing uh, at that time uh, because uh, of the cover is not the, such a powerful, so that's why I couldn't. Okay, uh, if you look at here, uh, this place, as you see here, I have uh, this place here. This is for bracing, okay, this is for bracing. Uh, but I couldn't uh, work with it or I couldn't model the bracing at that time because uh, I, I, didn't, I didn't have uh, a powerful computer. Okay, so uh, another uh, joint if I want to show you is the this joint here. Yeah? This with the con concrete with, uh, with beam. Okay, concrete with beam. No, I was sorry, concrete with uh, shear wall. With this, the, uh, this shear wall. Uh, anyhow, you see there are many joints here, and this is the cup for other <coughs> stories. Uh, this is splice connection in the columns. Anyhow, uh, let's take a look of some of the drawings, or some example. First of all, let's take a look for uh, some of the elevations just click here right click show camera detail I put some some cameras for that one but you can uh, use another another way for this one without uh, making cameras but I will show you in um, a, a special video which which uh, will be on my Patreon page uh, as uh, some many many golden tips I want to show you to just to be uh, uh, professional user in advanced steel okay as you see here we have uh, this place we have these bolts uh, everything is clear I think everything is very good and you can use it uh, whatever you want you can name it you can make the 
anything that you want is, is here here is the supplies connections and uh, here is the plates and the thickened plate we have many things that we have to consider uh, that we have to <coughs> model and uh, make drawings and this this axis uh, let me show you another axis uh, maybe which one is good let's say this one so just click the camera right click uh, show camera detail yeah and uh, this is here as you see again this is the splice connection and this is this splice connection in the column and this is the shear plates for the uh, secondary beams and this is the main beams girders everything is is good uh, let's take a look uh, some of the beams However, <coughs> I work with uh, another another drawing style. Okay, I work with another uh, drawing style. So uh, I want to show you some some of the drawings. So just click here and right click. Show uh, assembly detail. Okay, uh, this is simply for a column. Uh, as you see here, we have a single part because uh, these holes, as you see here, we have uh, some holes here, also again holes here. Uh, we have this one, this is a single part and we are using this drawing for making holes inside the, the, the beam. Okay, but this one for collecting or for assembly the plates. As you see here, we have uh, PL170 and we have uh, two, uh, two plates for F156 uh, so we have uh, this place again here this place is, uh, is uh, different than this plate and this plate also uh, different than this plate as you see we, here we have uh, column 111 111 uh, the cool thing with my uh, if you see uh, the uh, my drawing style the cool thing with my drawing style uh, uh, is to give you all the place also give you also uh, place also give you the uh, 3d drawing but I, I disabled uh, 3d drawing for this one so it gives you a uh, 3d drawing also as you see here the place the dimension of the place everything is is good and everything is clear uh, here so you can just use uh, again uh, this is the quantity of the of the uh, material uh, the quantity of the materials that used here as you see, F41 uh, is two, two uh, numbers, uh, F61 is one, and F154 uh, is two, F156 is two, 161 uh, and 170 is one. So it's, uh, everything is clear and everything is good. However, I, I uh, this drawing style, I lost one because I modified uh, with uh, this one. But uh, for the newer version, you can you can download it in, uh, on my Patreon page. Uh, you can download the my drawing style and I will put the a link uh, in the description below again uh, this the uh, the rest of the of the beams is the same thing let me open a, a new uh, or a beam uh, okay <coughs> if I make this way yeah, show a similar detail let's uh, take a look at this beam as you see here again we have sections inside we have plates here we have some plates here and we have everything detailed and it's very very clear uh, so uh, that's all for today I wanted to, to share with you uh, my uh, the model with you this is uh, for a seven story uh, building in Baghdad uh, which I modeled uh, about two years ago. Thank you very much.